Welcome back to the Mirror Camp YouTube channel. My name is Jack Wilcox. I'm a teacher at the Mirror Camp Online School, the only place on the internet where you can get coached by professional editors and creators like myself, get one on one feedback online calls where we teach you how to edit videos, how to be a professional content creator, learn the algorithms, etc. all things content, all things video editing. But say I'm going to show you how to get those Hollywood cinematic black bars right inside Premiere Pro. It's easy. I have two different ways for you. The first one is a bit more advanced, a bit more complex, but still easy. We're going to break down each step and show you how to do it. You also get a lot more customizability with the first way. And the second way I've made it so incredibly easy. Watch to the end of the video and I'll show you how to do it. The first step, we're going to jump right into Premiere Pro. And I have this clip, cinematic clip of this guy um, standing on a raft in the ocean. We're going to go over to the effects panel. We're going to search up crop. We're going to drag crop onto your clip. You're going to go to effects controls. Make sure your clip is selected. Scroll down to crop. I'd usually recommend about 12% top and bottom. Um, that means 12% on the top and the bottom of your image will be cropped in. And right away, you see those cinematic black bars. But if you want to do them more or less, feel free. You can customize it to your liking. So say, you know, this too much black bars, you know, 6% and 6%. Wait, hang on. Now you have a little bit more video real estate where your full video is being shown. Or on the flip side of it, say you want super big bars bump it up to like 25 and now it's like super zoomed in so as long as the top and bottom crop are the same you'll be fine but really i think 12 or 13 percent is the perfect um in between number but now you're probably asking just like a lot of my students ask me how do i get these on all of my other clips let me show you you'll go you'll click on your first clip whatever has the crop effect added to it you'll right click You'll press copy and then you'll select all the other clips in your timeline. Right click on these, go to paste attributes, make sure the crop effect is selected and press OK. And if you really wanted to spice it up, make things a bit even easier. You can always go to this button down here, click adjustment layer, press OK, dragging your adjustment layer here. And then you can just paste the crop effect onto your adjustment layer and you can do that as well. So let's talk about animating this. You have your cropped video. There's two ways to animate it. The first way is to do it so it goes from the full screen to you know a smaller percentage of screen. So what you'll do, you'll go to your video. It's cropped already. So you go to about one second in, keyframe your top and keyframe your bottom. And then you'll go to the beginning and you'll change the top to zero and the bottom to zero as well. Now it's the full screen and if you play it, it animates. So it goes full screen to more of a crop screen and you can take the last keyframes, highlight them both and drag it out to make it a slower crop or drag it in to make it a faster crop. Now there's another way to animate it as well. You'll delete your, your first keyframes and instead of setting the percentage crop to zero, you'll set it to 50, so 50 at the top, 50 at the bottom and now instead of it going from large to small it goes from nothing to something like this and before getting to the second part of this video guys make sure to subscribe i'm doing this for free i will literally show you how to make anything any tutorial you want effects transitions you see something on tv leave a comment below i will show you how to do it as long as you hit that subscribe button now part two guys i've made this so incredibly easy let me show you I've went ahead and I've made templates for this where you can just drag and drop. You can go to the link in our description. You can download these two templates. I have a 4K file and I have a 1080 file for you to just drag and drop. Let me show you how incredibly easy this is. So we have a 1920 by 1080 video, meaning we have a full HD video. So you will go to not the 4K file, you'll go to the 1080 file and you'll drag it right into your project. Now, guys, it's so easy. Right here, drag it on top of your clip, and bam, you have those cinematic black bars. Could not be easier. If that doesn't deserve a subscribe, I don't know what does. If you guys like these videos, make sure to check out our other ones. We have a ton of tutorials. And make sure, I mentioned this earlier, but leave a comment below. Tell me what you want to learn how to make. Effects, transitions, anything in the world, I will show you how to do it. Just leave a comment below. And if you like this video, I'm sure you like this one as well. Click here, check it out, and all the other videos. Don't forget to check out Mirror Camp and check out our online school for more. See you guys in the next one. Thank <music> you.